So hello guys, in this video I am going to demonstrate the android app that I have created for my Azura internship. This is an expense tracker application. I think we all can agree that today's youth expenses are going out of control. So this app will help to track the user's expenses and give them certain analytics that will help them to find out which things uh, they are spending the most amount of money and thus will help to reduce their expenses on these things if possible. So let us start with the ad app demonstration. So when we start this application for the first time, we are presented with an intro slider that gives us information about the various features of the application. Now this is the register page where the user has to fill some basic details. Next we arrive at the login screen where the user has to enter his username and password to login. After successfully logging in, the user is directed to the view expense screen. Since we haven't added any expenses yet, we are getting the message to add an expense by pressing the button below. We get three options. So let us go to, uh, to the add expense screen for now. Here the user can add any particular expense. Let me add a few expenses and show it to you. And now on adding these expenses, we see that these expenses are displayed on the view expense screen. Also we can view certain analytics of our expenses. So let us go to the view analytics screen. So this is the graph which is shown in landscape orientation. And this is the pie chart for the same. So from this analytics we can observe that we spend the most am amount of money on shopping. So now we can try to reduce the amount of spend on these shopping items. The last part of the demonstration is the logout functionality. So after logging out we are redirected to the register page. So this completes our demonstration of the android application. And lastly we would like to thank Tanmay sir, Ashish sir. Arpit sir and the whole Azura team for the support they have provided us throughout the project. Also I would like to thank the Slack community for the help they have provided us during the development process. Thank you for watching this video.